Uh, you can't see Mercury at this time of night, Moby. Dear Tim and Moby, What planet is closest to the sun? Love, Rexy 342. Mercury is the planet closest to the sun and the smallest planet in our solar system. Actually, since it's so close to the sun, most people can only see it at dawn, just before the sun rises, at dusk, just after the sun sets, or during a solar eclipse. Mercury's being so close to the sun also means that it switches back and forth between being extremely hot and extremely cold. During the daytime, temperatures on the equator can reach 430 degrees Celsius. That's hot enough to melt lead. And at night, especially inside craters at the poles, temperatures can go down to minus 180 degrees Celsius. It only takes 88 Earth days for Mercury to orbit the Sun. But it rotates really slowly, about once every 59 Earth days, which means that its day is almost as long as its year. A cool thing happens because Mercury rotates so slowly and orbits so fast. Sometimes the Sun moves backwards. Well, Mercury's orbit is really unusual. It moves from being very close to the Sun to being much farther away. By the time Mercury rotates once on its axis, it's already completed two-thirds of its orbit around the Sun. Compare that to Earth. In one day here, we've only completed a small fraction of our orbit. On Earth, the rotation of the planet makes the Sun appear to move across the sky. On Mercury, the Sun's path across the sky is influenced by both the rotation and the revolution. That makes the Sun's path there kind of weird. Oh, Mercury doesn't have any satellites, and it's only a little bigger than Earth's moon. In 1974, Mariner 10 showed that the exterior of Mercury looks a lot like our own moon, actually. It's barren and cratered. The information we got from Mariner 10 was surpassed by the images we received from a craft called Messenger, which entered Mercury's orbit in March 2011. It showed that Mercury's surface isn't just pocked with craters, there are smooth volcanic plains as well. Yeah, the inside of Mercury is a little like the Earth's inside. It has an iron core, and a rocky mantle, and a thin crust. The iron core gives it a magnetic field, but it's only about one hundredth as strong as Earth's. No, that's not Mercury either. Fine, it's Mercury.